Today is Friday, March 26th, and the gospel acclamation is, I am the resurrection and the life, says the Lord. Whoever believes in me, even if he dies, will live. And we, some of these passages that we've heard over and over again, we just take them for granted and don't look at them closely. And every time it says, well, Jesus healed everyone and Jesus will heal you, we can get this feeling, oh, someone died. Jesus promised them they wouldn't die if they believed in him. And that's not the meaning of life and death in the New Testament, in the Gospels. The meaning is that we will not die forever, not that we will never die if we believe in him, <laughs> see? So we kind of get confused about this. I think the reason is that we get confused is because it's so hard for us to fathom the fact that earthly life, even if it would be 60, 70, 80, 90 years, is as nothing compared to the infinite amount of time in the next life we will have with Jesus. And I think it would help us very much if every day we would contemplate what life in heaven will be like in whatever ways we can. But if you have difficulty imagining heaven, two theologian friends of mine, converts, Richard and Ruth Ballard and I wrote a book together called What the Saints Said About Heaven. And you can read all sorts of things that the saints said about heaven, which will help you to imagine it better and therefore to be less frightened of death on this earth. Amen. Mm -hmm.